Hey guys, it's Sergeant Kikas here and welcome back to the channel. And uh, we are back with a brand new YFM reaction and this time it's called This Is Why I'm Single. They've got it's featuring Shuba, Shuba, not sure, not heard of it before, but I'm sure it should be great. And cartoon wax that we all love guys. So excited for this. Let's jump straight into it. No, so all day every day people always ask me why I'm single and we've got the bill <laughs> billboard who wrote himself on a billboard of puff puff call puff call puff call puff if you want a hot date one eight hundred verified love it <laughs> and then obviously if puff's packing that under that red jumper damn he should be fine with ladies I'm assuming he's not I'm assuming that's why he's edit he's edited his head onto that because I've seen puff he looks relatively small he doesn't look that buff. <laughs> Here's the deal. I don't got good luck with the women, man. I pull up in my grandma's minivan. No hubcaps. <laughs> nice. So, he's going on a date. He doesn't have much luck with the women, he says. Because uh, he, he pulls up in his grandma's minivan. Doesn't have his own minivan. He pulls up in his grandma's. And by the looks of it, it's fucking shocked to shit. Jeez. I don't got good luck with the women, man. I pull up in my grandma's minivan. <laughs> no found. hubcaps. One mirror. Duct tape throughout the interior. <laughs> So, it's <laughs> no hubcaps, one of the fucking mirrors is fucking smashed off and gone, no one knows where that is, um, and then the seats are all duct taped together, fucking duct tape is the seat belts. she's fuming, look at her, she saw the billboard, thought this is going to be phenomenal, no, it's a shit out, <laughs> piece of shit. My grandma's minivan, no hubcaps, one mirror, duct tape throughout the interior, wheels falling off like a grocery cart, oh, no. headlights broke so it's always dark. Oh, I thought you said it was a push to start. Yeah, you gotta get out and push to start. You might. <laughs> so the wheels fall off like a grocery cart. The fucking screw flew, flies out. It's broken. The, you know they always fucking spin, and they get fucking stuck. Is it just fucking? They're just falling off. The fucking things are coming out. Um, <laughs> I thought you said it was a push to start. Yeah, you gotta get out and push it to start. Yeah, like it is. He didn't lie. He just. This led her a little bit, but he didn't like it's a push to start, you have to push the fucking thing. It's just not a button, it's a push to start. The lights are always going off, so it's always dark, as he said. That car's shocked to shit. See, Grandma just used it to nip to the shops and back, it's not an issue. He's trying to pull women with it, and it's just not working. And I'm gonna say, he doesn't look buff enough to be that bitch on the billboard. <laughs> Start. Oh, I thought you said it was a push to start. Yeah, you gotta get out and push to start. You might have to pay when I wine and dine. Malasita Cafe. Is that a reference? That's gonna be a reference to it. Malasita? I don't know. I'm missing that. But on the bumpers there, we get Gilf on board. Grandma's got a Facebook. Now she's sitting on my fridge. We know Grandma pulls. She is a Gilf. <laughs> and then Mima, obviously, is another name for Grandma. Um... So that's why that's an end and puff for president from the sticker. <laughs> Obviously in uh verified when he's gonna try and become president because he's uh because he's like thing. But because he's like verified. But that is the old puff design, not the new puff design, which is good. I like that. I love the old references to like the old designs of the character and stuff, that's cool. And then there's two handprints on the back, so maybe maybe grandma's getting a little bit busy. Maybe she's using that gill power and uh, putting it to good use. <laughs> push to start. Yeah, you gotta get out and push to start. You might have to pay when I wine and dine because my credit card's probably gonna get declined. Okay, my bad. I use oh, so when you wine and dine someone, you take them up for wine and dinner and stuff. And uh, yeah, he's saying, when I do that, uh, you might have to pay because my card's probably gonna get declined. I mean, this fucking paper clip holding it together. You might have to pay. When I wine and dine, because my credit card's probably gonna <laughs> look at that credit card. I'm sure that number's probably a reference to some I'm missing, but <laughs> there we go. He's got a fucking paper clip on his credit card to go and say, Yeah, she's probably gonna have to pay for this one. I'll be honest. Get declined, my bad. I use my sock as a napkin yeah. when I tell a joke, I'm the only one laughing. <laughs> so he uses a sock as a napkin. You know, as you do, and then when he <laughs> when I tell a joke, I'm the only one laughing. So he's using sock puppet. He thinks he's fucking Mick Foley. He's got a sock puppet. He's got Mr. Socko. He's whacked him out, and he thinks he's fucking hilarious. Puff, I'm sorry, it's not gonna work. You've got a sock in your fucking jumper as a napkin, mate. 
It's not looking good for you, pal. I use my sock as a napkin. When I tell a joke, I'm the only one laughing. I'm just an awkward dude. I stand too close when I talk to you. Fucking hell. I'm an awkward dude. I stand too close when I talk to you. Look at him. He's right up in her shit. Whispering in her ear. Just chill, man. Back off a bit. You've got your sock and your sock's gonna drop in her fucking dinner. And why are you making your sock puppet drink I'm the only wine? One laughing. I'm just an awkward dude. You can't afford that wine. She's fucking paid for that, and you're giving it to a fucking sock puppet. <laughs> oh dear. I stand too close when I talk to you, and when the waiter says, "Shadow man," we've got a shadow man back. This time he's a waiter. <laughs> I'm just an awkward dude. I stand too close when I talk to you. And when the waiter says, sir, enjoy your food, I say, thanks a lot. You too. Oh, uh -oh. oh no. No, we've all done that though, aren't we? Oh, God. When the waiter comes up to you and says, enjoy your food. Oh, yeah. Okay, thanks. You too. Like, oh, it's just the go-to response. Oh, it's so bad. But I've done it so many times. I worked in a fucking restaurant for three years. The amount of people that say it. And they just see embarrassment on their face after they do it. Oh, bless them. It's, oh, puff. You're not alone in that one, though, pal. <laughs> and when the waiter says, sir, enjoy your food, I say, thanks a lot. You too. All day, every day, people always ask. <laughs> Healthy intimacy of the hob. Oh, God, what's he going to pick? Also, I'm liking this little chorus cut. It seems pretty good. Thanks a lot. You too. All day, every oh, day, this. people always ask me why I'm single. Straight to the hob. All day, every day, people always ask him why I'm single. <laughs> oh, there's, there's quite too much. I'm assuming that's shuba, shuba. I don't know. This is why I'm single. I love it, but I hate it. It's the worstest and the greatest oh. when you're single. It's the worstest and the greatest when you're single. I mean, I don't. I didn't like it when I was single. I wouldn't say it's the greatest. I'm more on the worstest side, even though, you know, that's a legitimate word. Um, but, yeah, there you go. Um, this is why I'm single. He's put his re reasons out there, but then the cuts to him in the car alone. She's not with him, and she's left him in the restaurant alone. Let's hope his credit card doesn't get declined then. This is why I'm single. I wake up and it's time for lunch. A little Kool Aid and some Captain. So, first off, that's a shit owl. I mean, it's like every apartment in New York, innit? Exposed wall, pipes exposed, a broken blind. He's got some Kool Aid and some Captain Crunch. It's all over the floor. He shits everywhere. He's got a mattress and that's about it. Not even a lampshade. He's got a, a poster on the wall. But. He's got a cat, and that cat looks adorable. It's got a very cool pillow as well. The cat's living a better life than him. Cat's got a better bed. And rightly so. I wake up and it's time for lunch. A little Kool Aid and some Captain Crunch. That bowl's already on the floor. Is he using the same bowl every day? That's a bit grim. And is he putting milk in it, or is he just having it dry? I got no new matches. I don't know why. Oh. Honestly, I'm a really likable guy. He's got no new matches on Tinder. He don't know why. He's a nice, likable dude. Well, maybe it's because... I, I mean, got I mean, have you seen your apartment, mate? You live like a fucking... It's a shit off. You get a girl back there, she ain't coming back again. I got no new matches. I don't know why. Honestly, I'm a really... Also, put your cat on there. 100% getting a match. Likeable guy. I got low ambition. Afraid oh. of commitment. I He's pulled. He's got low ambition. Afraid of commitment, though. She's brought him a gift. How nice of her. That's really nice, but yeah, he's got no ambitions, afraid of commitment. I don't know why. Honestly, I'm a really likable guy. I got low ambition, afraid of commitment. I never listen, my mind is drifting, my cat. I never listen, my mind's drifting. Oh god, every guy's guilty of that, and they just mind runs off. I got low ambition, afraid of commitment. I never listen. But yeah, he's not got the best qualities, is he? Low ambition, afraid of commitment, his mind drifts off and he's not even listening to her. My mind is drifting, my cat went missing. Turns out he was in my kitchen, underneath the pile of dishes, my bedroom... The cat was found, and I just love how she went from, like, really worried to happy that the cat was found. Under a bunch of dishes, mate. Maybe do some... Washing up. I'm surprised he does. He has washing pots to do. To be honest, I'm afraid. I'm surprised he doesn't just use paper plates or the same bowl and just eat Captain Crunch every day. So I'm surprised he actually uses pots. It suggests he has cooked at least once in his life. But yeah, that cat is fucking adorable. Put that on your Tinder profile, mate. You're getting at least another bird. 
bird. Oh god, that's cringe. You're getting some girls if you put a cat on there. And my cat went missing. Turns out he was in my kitchen. Under She's fuming. Look at her. Eat the pile of dishes. Oh, my oh. bedroom doesn't have much decor. Oh, no, it doesn't. Indeed. Turns out he was in my kitchen. Underneath the pile of dishes. Oh, my bedroom. Doesn't have much so his bedroom doesn't have much decor. So it's got the broken blind we've seen. It's got dish on the floor. It's got a bong, Captain Crunch, empty Kool Aid, and a post that says "Hi" as a kite. Oh, and the other post still the smiley face. I'll be on it and a shitty mattress. It's look worn and fucked. I'll be honest, mate. Maybe just get a table or a bed. Went missing. Turns out he was in my kitchen underneath the pile of dishes. Oh, my are. bedroom doesn't have much decor. There's a sheet hanging up where there should be a door. I got a worn out mattress on a hardwood floor. She's not even got a fucking door. He's just got a piece of fucking. She's got a shower curtain with a door painted on it. And he's got a fucking worn out mattress, a hardwood floor. I bet his back's doing no good. That must be pain. Doesn't have much decor. There's a sheet hanging up where there should be a door. I got a worn out mattress on a hardwood floor. Every morning I wake up and my back is sore. My Tinder profile is not a flex. <laughs> so his back's sore every morning he wakes up. There's a fucking little mallet underneath the fucking thing no wonder it hurts you got a mallet under your mattress pal yeah your tinder profile's no flex i mean no no likes no messages no matches i mean i'll be honest mate you're fucking you've not done well you're not doing great wax i mean just as like i said put your cat on there and maybe i'll have a picture of you looking high as fuck might help <laughs> On a hardwood floor, every morning I wake up and my back is sore. My Tinder profile is not a flex. My main picture is of me and my ex, but hey, being oh, single's not that bad. I do what I want and it's <laughs> Oh well so his main profile is a picture of him and his ex, which we can see on the shelf there with the love hearts on. So he's still off easy call up on his ex. You can't have a picture of you and your ex as your main Tinder profile picture. He's also got the puff puff plushie. Nice promotion there. Love it. Um but so he's got his priorities straight, he's gotta get the puff puff plushie. Him and his cat are chilling. But he's not too bothered, he don't mind being single. He's got all different types of cereal there, so he doesn't just drink Captain Crunch. It's eat Captain Crunch, but she's left. She took a gift with him. Sorry, pal. None for you. Picture is of me and my ex, but hey, being single's not that Oh, she flipped the bird at him. Bad. I do what I want and it saves me care. I love this little high five with the cat. It's not that bad. I do what I want and it saves me care. So I mean, yeah, you don't look like you've got much anyway, so save as much as it if you can, pal. <laughs> Saves, I just love the saves me cash. <laughs> the way he says it, that's great. All day, yeah. I don't know what I just did there, someone popped up on the screen. Every day, people always ask <laughs> cuddle or sleep diagonally. Say, so, do you want to cuddle up with a girl, keep warm, get physical intimacy, or do you want to sleep diagonally across your bed? I mean, you've got no fucking sheets, pal, so either way, it's not great, but. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, cuddles the correct answer, isn't it? But let me guess, he's gonna go for sleep diagonally. I love it, but I hate it. It's the worstest and the greatest when I'm single. <laughs> this is why I'm single. I actually really like the chorus. I like the way it's a different, like, tune to what we've seen recently. We've had sort of high energetic bait, like, attack sort of <laughs> attack sort of music but this is sort of more calm reserved i like it i like it also i'm loving these dance moves from the characters i love it but i hate it it's the worstest and the greatest when you're saying <laughs> he's doing the guru dance i fucking love it oh wax you are killing it oh how are you not pulling the women with that this is why i'm single Hey, so DJ, DJ's now actually got, I saw they announced it, there's a new guy actually voicing DJ, whereas in the past Ray voiced DJ as well, they've now actually got a new guy that's come in and he's doing DJ, so I assume in the next few songs we're going to hear DJ singing and things like that, so I'm excited for that, but here we go, DJ, let's go. This is why I'm single. Ha -ha. If you did it by yourself tonight, huh, hold your own hand. <laughs> So if you live by yourself, hold your own hand. You got it, guys. Don't worry. If you're lonely, hold your own hand, and you won't be just alone. You you'll be touching at least a human. <laughs> I'm loving these dance moves by uh, DJ. By the way, he's killing them. 
<laughs> if you love that feeling of independence mixed with that feeling of soul crushing loneliness, make some noise. <laughs> Fucking hell. Oh, the silence. If you hate the silence of the soul crushing loneliness, make some noise. Like he's trying to hype you up in a club, but it's just make any noise. And then it's not the soul crushing loneliness silence. Oh, wow. That's amazing. Oh, I love that little. In just nice way to introduce the new guy doing the DJ voice. Get him in there. He's got some cool dance moves and he's uh, insulting everyone who's single. <laughs> Fantastic. Good job, DJ. Mixed with that feeling of soul crushing loneliness. Mixed noise. I'm single because I squawk like a chicken. I'm single because I can't make decisions. I'm single because I'm awkward as hell. Because I eat Taco Bell like I'm paid by the minute. <laughs> so, how relatable is that? So, she squawks like a chicken. Oh, wow. Um, I mean, we've all had those times where our voice breaks at the worst time. Uh, she can't make decisions. I feel like that's 99% of people now. You're going through Netflix, you cannot find something to watch. Like, you just like, you can't choose what you want to watch. There's about 50 things you've said you want to watch, but you never you can never choose. Clumsy as hell, or awkward as hell. I'm clumsy as shit, I fucking, oh, I'm so fucking clumsy, man. Um, and then she eats Taco Bell like it's made by the minute. So I like the little beat change by, uh, quickly it's very good how they're changing the beats throughout the song it keeps it interesting keeps it good and it's got good different energies for all the different characters i think that's really good really really good shuba very good voice go on girl um but yeah so <laughs> said it's some good stuff so she's awkward she eats taco bell like mad love it can't make decisions i'm single because i'm awkward as hell because i eat taco bell like i'm paid by the minute i want to talk about my ex on the first date i ordered lots of food but i never paid <laughs> So she uh, she talks about her ex and just says how amazing her ex is on the first date. And she'll order fuck tons of food. She's got the taco party fat there. Oh, I shouldn't know that. I should not know what the... T I should not know the name of that. I've never ordered it, I promise. It's the 10 tacos you get. <laughs> I promise I've never ordered it. I know that makes it sound like I have. <laughs> But yeah, so she's ordering fuck tons of food for herself. And she's not paying, that knobhead there is paying. I don't know why he's doing a fucking bird dance right here. But he is. Shadow Man's just stole his credit card to go take the payment. Hey, by the minute. I wanted to talk about my ex on the first date. I ordered lots of food, but I never pay. Then I get the guy to spill all of his fantasies. But I never tell him anything about me. <laughs> so she gets him to talk about his fantasies and his dreams and all these things and these his secrets and stuff. But she's going to be zipped tight lipped she's fucking turning into zippy from fucking rainbow so this guy's gonna go after to talk to george or fucking bungle instead who preferably actually less annoying and better anyway but yeah <laughs> she's turned into fucking zippy from rainbow but i never pay then i get the guy to spill all of his fantasies but i never tell him anything about me no no <laughs> wait is that a really niche reference did you have rainbow in america or is that a really just niche unknown reference bungle zippy and george from rainbow she's turned into zippy it's great yeah you, is that, let me know down below because i don't know how many people are actually going to get that reference can't remember people's names so i say hey buddy <laughs> she can't remember people's names she says hey buddy i mean you always have those situations someone's talking to you it's like someone from school who you don't fucking remember they come up they say your name do not remember them at all. I mean, he, he saw it straight away. He was like, hmm. When she said, hey, buddy. Because she's saying, hey, buddy. Because she doesn't remember the name. But it's really awkward, those situations. We've all had them, haven't we? Let's be honest. No, no. I can't remember people's names. So I say, hey, buddy. I laugh at random times when nothing's even funny. <laughs> so she's laughing at times when, people, when nothing's even funny. She's loving it at the cinema. Hey, I mean... She's fucking pissing herself. Everyone else is sad. She's laughing at Schindler's list. <laughs> fucking hell. She's finding it hilarious. It's not even funny. Everyone else looks really sad. She's pissing herself. And oh dear. And he tries to run off and she grabs him and pulls it back. You ain't going nowhere, bitch. <laughs> She's requesting 27 payback from Puff. I mean, Puff's fucking... Have you seen his car? There's no chance he's got 27 payback to give you, but she's been knowing him for fucking spare change. Like, oh dear. 
Why are all the shadow people holding hands? Like all of them. Everyone's holding is there some just one fucking group orgy? Okay no. Not even just asking, she's reminding him now. Fucking hell. Oh dear, she's in the uh, thing. Everyone's got the same shit in their basket. They've all got a, pizza, a slice of bread, some cheese, some but wine or some shit, and vinegar or some fucking crap. They've all got the same four items, and there's only about six items in the shop. Get a melon in there and some eggs, and you're all sorted, boys. <laughs> all got the same items. Oh dear. <laughs> She's singing in public like the words are I mean, there's two people absolute, three people absolutely loving it. Three, four people absolutely hate it. He's fucking run off. He's gone. He's not liking her singing in public. But the words her say, she's singing in public. She's loving it. Living, loving life. But he's gone. He's fucking out of there. I mean, that one on the left, second one down, he's looking at her a bit too weirdly. I don't know about that. Fucking hashtag me too. No. Like the world is my stage All day, every day, people oh, always move. Ooh, share food or total isolation I mean, that's a tough one, isn't it? I mean, I think we know she's going for total isolation Because she eats shit tons of food Just ask me why I'm single Life is why I'm single I love it, but I hate it It's the worstest and the greatest when you're single This is why I'm single Nice. Bam. Oh, guys, I absolutely loved that. I hope you enjoyed it too. That was really good. I liked the way it changed up the beats, the different paces of throughout the song. Kept it really interesting. M multiple different people singing. The switch up with DJ in the middle as well broke up really nice. I think that's one of my favourite they've released recently. That's really, really good. I'm, I'm good. At, um, I think that's better than Brain Rave, personally. I do like Brain Rave, but I think this one is better for me a lot of people disagree with that but yes guys i hope you enjoyed this as um as well as always erb at uh, the erb or yfm you have smashed it cartoon wax killed as always and shuba shuba whatever your name is you are very welcome back on yfm again because you did a great job great verse beautiful voice amazing you i'm sure we're gonna see her in future videos as well in future songs as well very very good very excited to see future ones oh guys i hope you did enjoy if you did leave your leave a comment down below saying what you thought the song favorite lines maybe what you thought she thought was good bad whatever as always i'll put a poll up tomorrow or the day of this is released either the two either one of the two <laughs> but yeah guys if you did enjoy hit that like button smash subscribe for more videos in the future hopefully we're a bit more regular again and i'll see you next time peace